Well, the first show I ever saw was in the Project Art Center in Dublin, um, right behind what is now, well, it was then the Clarence Hotel. And at the time, um, the Project Art Center was being run by Jim Sheridan, who later became film director of some note, and his brother Peter. And um, they would put on the occasional concert, and you two were doing a gig there when I saw them. And what you saw in them on that occasion, that certain something, is that still there? Do you still see it now? Yeah. It's a, it's a, I mean, it's, it's, it's surprisingly the same, you know. I mean, the positions they occupy on stage are the same, the instruments they play are the same. It's all got a bit more complicated. We need a few more people to help. Um, the crew, I think, in those days was one. Um, and it seems to have been increasing in number ever since. I mean, they were always very theatrical. I mean, Bono, Bono right at the beginning, had a, a, a kind of hunger for contact with the audience, which is, which is still the basis of his stage persona. Um, in those days, in the 70s, it was very uncool. P punk was quite an aloof performance um, kind of convention. And a lot of the, the punk frontmen um, really disdained the audience and didn't make much contact with them. Bono was hungry for contact with them, was looking at them, looking them in the eye. So being on stage was never something that you two did reluctantly or as a means to an end. It was fundamental to being the band. 